<laughs> if you're here for technical reasons and uh, scientific stuff, you're here at the wrong channel. Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Just want to give you a quick update on that video I did two days ago regarding the whole uh, full power cycle and the issue I had with autopilot. It was a twofold video. It was for one, the, power, the, the pro tip for the full power cycle. I wanted to show you guys how to do that in, in the event of issues, but I also wanted to let you know that I had that autopilot issue and I thought it was just me, but after some uh, research, after I did the video, I realized this is a big 16.2 issue with a lot of people. A lot of people are having it. And then the video posted and um, the, my apologies. I should have told you guys uh, soon after that full power cycle didn't work. Um, this is beyond that. So that full power cycle works for little things, uh, other issues and stuff like that, that maybe a soft reboot or a hard reboot won't work for. But for um, something like this, and I'll tell, I'll explain to you why it didn't work. One of the subscribers on YouTube, George Larkin, I got to give him full credit and full shout out. This is his um, answer and this is what I did and now it's working. So what George told me folks, it's a problem with 16.2 and the new feature in 16.2, how you can deactivate certain parts of sentry mode or you can keep sentry mode on all the time. Like, you know, you can deactivate it when it's at home or when it's at work or favorites and stuff like that. The problem is, is if you keep it on all the time and you don't have it, uh, shutting off at home or shutting off at work or something like that. Sentry mode is uh, recording the whole entire time and there's, uh, I guess the uh, full self-driving computer or some part of the computer or the system is not getting a, a sleep cycle. It's, it's, it's on constantly. When you're driving, it's on. When you park, it's on. And it needs some kind of, um, uh, some, some kind of a sleep cycle to have a, a break in between. Tesla is aware of this now and uh, they're doing a fix for it. I think there's a 16.3. I don't know if that 16.3 addresses the problem, but there is a 16.3 coming out. I know it's online that it's rolling out to very, very small amounts of people. So, so that's the issue, folks. So the way I fixed it is, or anyone else that has that problem, all you have to do is turn off sentry mode or have it or click off that one uh, selection where when it's at home, it doesn't come on. Um, or when it's at work, it doesn't come on. It's just enough to give it some kind of an episode where it can sleep and not have a full sleep cycle, but just have it rest for some period of time because just like us, the computer needs to rest sometimes and it, without it resting, I guess it just gets fatigued or overworked or something. Now I'm dumbing it down. There's obviously a scientific and a much more technical reason for it. I'm, <laughs> if you're here for technical reasons and uh, scientific stuff, you're, you're here at the wrong channel. I'm just giving you the real world basic explanation of it, folks, because from what I know. But anyways, I did it last night and <laughs> my autopilot works like a charm. The cameras are back up and running. I can do a park. My auto high beams work. My um, auto wipers work. I can see the lines. I can go in autopilot. My cruise control, like something simple as cruise control. My cruise control works now, folks. So that is a quick update. If you have this problem in 16. To where your autopilot goes or your uh, uh, traffic where cruise control goes do this fix make sure your sentry mode is off for a period of time what i did like i said is i just turned it off during the night time i went to sleep woke up this morning put the car in drive went around my block and it's working perfectly so that's all i got for you today folks thanks for watching we'll see you on the next one if you have that problem or you have that problem and it's not working leave a comment below let me know why and we'll try to figure it out ourselves somehow see ya